Hey everybody, I'm Recycled, and welcome back to Let's Play Boneworks. Let's go. This is the, uh, second level. Do I have any inventory? No, I don't. I started out fresh. So it'd be nice right now if we had some kind of weapon. Gotta go this way. Can't go any other way. Not really. Not without glitching the physics. Maybe you could jump up that wall. I've never done it. These guys are new. They weren't there before. I mean, if you played it earlier, they weren't there. That's pretty good. Yeah, I will save. Eh. Oh, yeah. Right there. You're looking at me like I suck or something. Eh. Okay, so this dude's here. Don't make noise. Whatever. Just gotta sneak through here kind of quietly. Don't touch him. Oh, but bitch, I got a hammer. I'll touch you all over. <laughs> Die. Die. Don't touch me. Your hands hurt. Okay. Well, anyway. Dual fisting this thing. Gotta break these. Oh, come on. I'm nailing it. It's already open. Who am I kidding? Guys, come and join uh, Digital Logic, the podcast. Come watch it. We talk about PC games weekly. Mostly Steam, but, you know... Basically anything you can play with a PC. Also some console talk too. A lot of his own consoles. Bobby's a cool dude. The king of sideburns. It's not necessary to kill these guys. But I feel safer if I do. Don't know what that thing is. Uh this one, I think. Yeah. Um, alright. Well, gotta keep moving. All monogon employees are instructed to Ah, you'll need this. Shut the up. It only shoots at your face. If it can't see you, it won't shoot. But if it sees you, even by one pixel, it will. Alright, so anyway. Um, some fun we can have back here and get some ammo. But basically, uh, yeah. Stop it. Yeah, you can't, like, uh, grab these things from far away. And the silly thing about ammo, if it happens to get caught under one of those pieces of wood or something, you can't force grab it. Otherwise, you can force grab this stuff all day. So that's good. Oh, yeah, I definitely need this. Otherwise, we're going to die like crazy. All right. We don't need this thing anymore. We could use it later on. But basically, just... Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Button does nothing, of course. I would carry this thing with me, but... There's no place to put it in my inventory. And... It's, like, really huge. Kinda works. Um, I don't know. I guess we'll try to carry it. <sighs> this weapon sucks. What's in here? It's a superior weapon. I will take that. This door goes nowhere. Um, there's something you have to do here. Okay, we want to do this. Yeah, leave that open. Because we can get some more goodies. Uh, do I have room on my, uh... 
Right here. I think. No. I want to put it somewhere. But I don't know where that is. Like, is it... Oh, I don't want to put that there. Okay. Whatever. Anyway. I'm kind of OCD, so I like to get these things slid over like as far as they can go. Otherwise, I feel like I'm not really... I'm going to pay for it later, basically. That's what OCD is all about, basically. It's like, if I don't do this right, right here, that I notice the details I can fix, then I'm going to be paying for it later, and then I'm going to be regretful, and then it's some situation I can't go back to. That's what OCD is about for me. Um... So I recognize myself screwing my, my own self by uh, my obsessive and compulsive behavior, wasting my time, wasting other people's time. That's the worst, honestly. Why should I waste someone else's time? Okay, so we can get a gun, and uh, we wouldn't be able to take it with us, but we already have that pretty cool uh, thing. I mean, we have... Oh, could we get a gun? We couldn't really afford it. No, nah, we couldn't afford a gun. Eh. Maybe you can get more bullets by this point, but I didn't. So before you drop down here, make sure you open that door, otherwise you have to go all the way around. Report Report any unauthorized unauthorized activities not very fun. Here, oh yeah, if I had that um, trash can lid that I said I was going to bring, now would be a great time to have it. Because there's uh, guns right there shooting at us. And uh... Oh, oh, yeah, I died. That sucks. Nope, I'm not going to kill them. Alright, let's actually take this with us. It'd be nice if we could put these in your inventory. I mean, I guess we begged them enough to give us save points, but that was pretty obvious. If you're a dev of this game, you probably played it so much that the save points seemed unnecessary. There's another weapon over here, but it's not really any better than the one we had. Although, since we died... Yeah, we don't have a weapon, so we'll take this. I did not put it away. How is that possible? Are you serious? There's nothing here. Oh, yeah. Oh, you don't even lose your weapons? Well, heck. Dying doesn't even matter. You just have to walk back to where you were. Alright. So basically, you want to go behind these guns. You can't do it. Alright, because there's ammo. Ugh. Oh, you have to pull it. <laughs> Come on. I know I can do it. Yeah, I want to pick up the whole freaking thing. Alright. Nope. VR problems. Pull thing. Okay. Nope. All right, all right. I want this thing. Alright. Yep. Yeah, nope. I never had that problem before. Shut up. Okay, so. In here. There's more ammo. That was a lot of trouble just for that. Alright, well, let's get out of here. And these things did not unslide. Are you serious? I, I slid them and they went back? Oh, because I died. There's some ammo around here. You can find ammo all over the place, but it's a uh, sort of a waste of time. You get enough ammo. They're not slid. Okay, I'm cutting this part. Yeah, you gotta go a long go away. Super long. Oh, and these guys are out. Oh, and those guys are out. That's not good. Uh, we're probably going to die, but while they're... Nope, don't look at me, buddy. Cross around the other guy. I need to... Do this, otherwise I'm definitely gonna die. They usually kill themselves. 
Yeah, but if I can kill this guy quickly, then I'll get credit for it. I just need to kill this one guy. Stop moving, man. Give me credit. I got credit. Wow, that's amazing. Okay, that was very lucky. That's crazy. Yeah, if you have to get into a fight with a melee weapon against guys with guns, it doesn't always go your way, honestly. It's pretty tricky. But the way that uh, you take damage in this game, it's like you have regenerating health, but if you pass a critical threshold, then you'll die. But if you manage to kill someone, really? It's not even moving. It doesn't even move. <laughs> okay, that's a glitch. Fix that, Valve, or stress level zero. It doesn't even animate. What the hell? Still can't afford it. I haven't shot any bullets yet. Okay, so if you've done that properly, you can come back here. There's more guys. Hello, do you see me? Look up. Too late. <laughs> I'll hit you in the butt cheek. Alright, and you can't, like, uh, force grab these things. Whatever. Give me this. What that? Give me. I got it. Okay. I guess there's probably no more bad guys over here. Yep, not really. So I think what happens is that if you throw items in this bin, then they'll reappear in the bin. But if they're on your body, then I think it just saves them. I don't know. I guess I haven't died very much to find out, but basically it's there to help you. When the game shipped, these did not exist. And basically, if you took your time getting through the game and you were very explorey and slow, it would be devastating when you had to walk away from the game because you had a surprise guest or you had to go do something and uh, you came back and you had to restart the whole level. Good God. Okay, well anyway. Eh. Okay. Yeah, and it behooves me to get these levels done quickly because otherwise the episodes are going to be super duper long. If I know anything about YouTube, nobody wants to watch an episode of anything that lasts longer than about 20 minutes. 30 minutes seems like a good length to me though. No one cares about my stupid opinion. Of course. Why should they? I agree with you all. Form your own opinions. Um, you gotta take some of these with you. Man, oh god, no, don't do it. Ah, help, someone help me. Ah, it's a... <laughs> well, that's new. Okay, so the question is... Yeah, we have all our stuff. Like, it didn't even matter. Okay, well that's great. Oh, I was gonna say... Yeah, when I first did this puzzle, I didn't know what the heck I was doing. So I was standing on that part over there, and every time the boxes would fall down, I had to take out my weapon and just break them up. <laughs> because they get stuck on these little uh, gates, because this whole thing slides over. It was silly, and I was like standing on this part and moving those those red things. Anyway, it's, it's just stupid. <laughs> you need to bring these with you. At least a couple of them. Okay, and that's why I died. But, but what you're supposed to do is uh, go down there 
You don't really have to go this way. Am I skinny enough? Can I do it? I'm stuck in a weird way. Okay. Yeah, you're supposed to use this thing. Come on. I'm doing it. Go. Yeah, all those stupid little boxes are stuck on it. So it's hard to move. Yeah, and then we're done. Normally we'd be able to walk on something like this, but this one's special. Even though it's so tilty, you can still walk on it. Gotta go this way. Did I do that right? Okay, here's what I did. I got the boxes over there. Yeah, I did it right. Okay, since the platform's in the middle, you won't fall through these uh, bendy thingies. So you can come over here with your things. And is that good enough? Get on there. All right. Um, you didn't do it. Get on there. Okay. And then you need one of these. You can use a bigger one too, of course. But they can break. These things are indestructible. I like them because they never break. So I can jump up here and I can, I can jump oh, and I can grab this. All right. Come on, keep going. My stupid legs are in the way. Can I tuck them up a little bit? We're in there, right? Come on, legs, don't do this to me. All right, we're inside, let's go. Yeah. So. Yo, Arthur, over here. How are you still in the city? The board's calling an emergency meeting for all Monogon employees. All of Mytho West is on lockdown. It's crazy over here. I have no idea how you weren't kicked. Like, nobody else can log in. The system clock being frozen might have something to do with it. So if you can More make them? your way to the oh, board shit. tower, you might be able to manually restart it and let us back in. Yeah, something annoying. I didn't really have this problem when I was using wands, but after I switched to knuckles, I also had this problem. If I'm looking down and trying to grab stuff, I'm constantly pulling ammo out of my belt. And once you do that, you have you're stuck with it. I don't want to shoot this thing one-handed. Really? It's empty already? Oh, it only had one in the chamber. And I have to do this again? What happened? Alright, well, at least I could carry this. Without uh pulling it off my belt. See, in this case, I guess I would drop that there. And, uh, I've got to put this away. Um. This is cool. You're meant to see this. Yeah, it's a giant vacuum cleaner. I pick stuff up. I can't put this there, but I can put it here. Alright, let's save that shit. Yeah, and, uh, I don't know how you access this spot, but it's there. I'm just carrying this around. Eh. I just have to carry this ammo, otherwise I'm gonna lose it. So if you ever watched the speed run of this by, uh, I think Zichka, and I should spell that, it's S-Y-C-H-K-E. He runs this game, and man, he makes mince meat out of this level. No, you don't. You don't do that. All right. So, you definitely want to shoot this thing two-handed, instead of one-handed. It's a lot more uh, accurate that way. But I guess it works pretty good one-handed. Now we can finally do this. Alright. I can hit anything. Yay, we did it. And it's definitely more uh, efficient to actually use melee weapons to get the ammo boxes open and stuff, but I'm kind of in a hurry. I just want to get these episodes pumped out. Basically, just need more content, man. I neglected my channel and I paid for it. People loved my uh, original Fallout Let's Play. I don't know if it was the algorithm that chose me. Or it was just the time for Fallout, and everyone was searching for Fallout, and they were like, what's this? They ended up watching it. I had like 10,000 views on my first episode. 
But anyway, it's kind of gross if I'm gloating over my own shit. I should just keep putting out quality content and uh, see where it takes me. Don't be like some people bitching about, oh, you guys hang out here and you don't subscribe. <laughs> no, sir. Don't do that. Um, there is a thing here. Yeah, that's a, oh hey, what's up? I thought you were dead. Yeah, yeah. There's a thing here you can get. It's up there, and uh, since I'm pretty good at getting it, then I guess I will. Uh, move thing, move, and then take this thing and. You gotta make some kind of ramp, basically. Is that the best way to do this? Probably not. But whatever. Come here. No, come here. Come. Come here. Yes, like that. That's good enough. I can make that jump. Whoa. Yeah, you can't uh, grab every surface, but the surfaces you can't grab, you can still kind of put your palms on it. And yeah, I had trouble with this, and I think what I did that changed it was changing my uh, floor offset height. So basically, the way you want to jump is scrunch down a little ball, press jump, and then, um, where is it? Uh, yeah, anyway, you just jump. <laughs> And if you do slow-mo, it helps a lot. But to get over ledges, you got to scrunch your legs up, man. And then you can do it. And you can get up here. So these ledges, man. Just get it. Okay, yeah, these platforms, man, they're so easy to fall off. I think the best thing to do is just, uh, get where you can, like, actually grab the next one. Okay, that did not go so well. Come on, dude. Let me on. All right. Yeah, then falling from here is kind of annoying. For obvious reasons. You gotta come on back up, it's a pain. Yeah, but basically just doing that ledge grabby thing, like I said, you can do it. All right, almost there. I don't know if you can grab this ledge. Oh, you can't. Well, anyway, I'm not going to waste any more time on this. It's a pain. You get it. I've already gotten it. I think it was one of the things that was in our uh, dealio when we started. If I had a key, I could go in here, but I already used my key. I did not take it with me, so we're not going in there. Let's just go. These levels are really long. Let's just go through the long level. I did not break the glass. I'll break this glass though. You already have one of these. Yeah. What? Let's get some melons. Hey. There's no fall damage. Uh, I have a gun. It's in a weird slot though. All right. Cause that guy has a gun. Levels are humongous, dude. And I don't know how you're supposed to do this one. 
But what I always do, is there a place on my body I can put this where I can just grab it? Um, I don't need two melee weapons. This one seems pretty good, so I'm gonna do that, and then I can do like this. Really? When I have this open, I can't? When I have this open, I can't. Okay. Yeah, what I do is I just always... Well, if I want this to stay on here, I better take the whole pallet. Okay. I just do like this. I never solved... I guess... I think there's another way to solve this that's like the proper way. But I never figured it out. And to this day, I just do this. Just smush this in, man. Smush it. Smush it in good. Alright. So it's in there really good. Alright. And I don't want this to fall over if we can help it. Can we put this down so it stops falling? Okay, and then I can get the heck out of here. Alright. Just move this over a little, man. Just, just get it where it's really... Okay, so these bars are captive, otherwise they could slide. So we did that, and I want to open this. I guess I could just use my gun for everything. Yeah. You know, I'm cross-dominant with my eyes. See, I'm holding the gun right-handed, but my left eye is the one that shows the clearest sight image. So that really sucks. If I joined the armed forces, they probably would have required me to wear glasses. I don't. I have astigmatism in one eye. Let's get up there. You can bring these things with you, but I don't think you need to. There's enough of them up here. So basically, you come up, and it's like, you need to make a bridge. Um, I could use one piece, and then I guess I'll go and get one of those other pieces. Yeah, there's plenty of pieces up here. So this is kind of kludgy, and hopefully you have good tracking and stuff. Otherwise, <laughs> you could have some problems here with these things. They're really kind of crazy. Alright. That'll work. That'll work. That'll do, pig. That'll do. Okay, and I need another one. Give me another one. Yeah, it's like... The levels are just really long. Um, and I want these videos to be... Like, uh, segmented. Like, one per level would be obvious, right? That does not look very safe. Um... Don't drop it anywhere, but okay, that'll do it. All right, let's go. Open. <laughs> okay, so there's this thing. It's already ready for us because of what we did earlier where I shoved those boxes by the levers. And we can just go across here and they won't... Ugh, they won't move very far. I hear enemies. I don't see them. Okay, well, whatever. Because of my OCD, I like to move all these things off to give myself more power, but it probably doesn't matter. Oh! Wow, we went far. I want my gun, man. Clear. Not that I want to use a submachine gun for such long shots like that. Um, you can go down here, but I don't think there's really any reason to, so I'm not gonna. There might be ammo or something, I forget. Hey, the reclamation bin! It's down there! Whee! And there's uh, some bad guys can sneak up on you here, but basically, we're done. Um, the stuff we throw in here will be available in Sandbox. I didn't get anything to save 
or sandbox unless I needed a gun or something. I don't really care. And if I did need it, I could just go get it pretty easily. I don't really play sandbox, but it's nice. I don't know. They're collectibles, man. Gotta collect them all. So, that's the end of episode two. If you've been watching, thanks. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.